Hi, I'm Jerry James Stone and you're watching Cooking Stone. And you might notice, well, I'm not in my regular kitchen. In fact, I'm in this lovely Airbnb loft which is located in San Diego's Little Italy district. And for that reason, I'm gonna show you how to make amazing pasta and all the tips and tricks that you need to do it. First off, for every quarter pound of pasta that you're gonna cook, you want about a quart of water. And for that quart of water, you want one tablespoon of salt. Now you might've been told that adding salt to the water makes it cook faster. That's not true. While salted water does actually cook faster, the amount of salt that you would have to add would make the pasta pretty inedible. So the, the amount that you're adding here, the tablespoon per quart, is really just for flavor. So when you're making pasta, you want the water to be like a roaring boil, like no simmer. It has to be full throttle. And then add in the dry pasta. Do not add in olive oil. You might have been told to add olive oil because it prevents pasta from sticking, but the only thing it does is prevent the, the sauce from sticking to the pasta. Olive oil in the water is a major no-no. So the pasta's cooking, you have it in the pot, you wanna test and see if it's done. You might have been told to throw it against the wall and see if it sticks. It's a horrible way to test your pasta. The best way to test it is to actually just taste it. Like, throwing it against the wall does nothing. It doesn't actually, it's not an indicator for if the pasta's done and it just makes your walls messy. So, a couple minutes before the final mark, test your pasta, see if it's ready to go, check it every few sec, every 20 seconds, and when it's ready, take the pasta out of the water and transfer it directly into your pot of sauce. You can drain it, but just don't rinse it. That starchy water that you built up by boiling your pasta is what allows the sauce to stick to it. And also that starchy water is great for kind of making the sauce a little bit more creamy. So rinsing it is a major no-no. And there you go, you'll have the perfect plate of pasta. Accommodations provided by Airbnb.